Proverbs chapter 12, King James Version. All others are perversions. They promote truth decay. Whoso loveth instruction loveth knowledge, but he that hateth reproof is brutish. A good man obtaineth favor of the Lord, but a man of wicked devices will he condemn. A man shall not be established by wickedness, but the root of the righteous shall not be moved. A virtuous woman is a crown to her husband, but she that maketh shame is a rottenness in his bones. The thoughts of the righteous are right, but the counsels of the wicked are deceit. The words of the wicked are to lie and wait for blood, but the mouth of the upright shall deliver them. The wicked are overthrown and are not, but the house of the righteous shall stand. A man shall be commended according to his wisdom, but he that is of a perverse heart shall be despised. He that is despised and hath a servant is better than he that honoreth himself and lacketh bread. A righteous man regardeth the life of his beast, but the tender mercies of the wicked are cruel. He that tilleth his land shall be satisfied with bread, but he that followeth vain persons is void of understanding. The wicked desireth the net of evil men, but the root of the righteous yieldeth fruit. The wicked is snared by the transgression of his lips, but the just shall come out of trouble. A man shall be satisfied with good by the fruit of his mouth, and the recompense of a man's hands shall be rendered unto him. The way of a fool is right in his own eyes, but he that hearkeneth unto counsel is wise. A fool's wrath is presently known, but a prudent man covereth shame. He that speaketh truth sheweth forth righteousness, but a false witness deceit. There is that speaketh like the piercings of a sword, but the tongue of the wise is health. The lip of truth shall be established forever, but a lying tongue is but for a moment. Deceit is in the heart of them that imagine evil. But to the counselors of peace is joy. There shall no evil happen to the just, but the wicked shall be filled with mischief. Lying lips are abomination to the Lord, but they that deal truly with it are his delight. A prudent man concealeth knowledge, but the heart of fools proclaimeth foolishness. The hand of the diligent shall bear rule, but the slothful shall be under tribute. Heaviness in the heart of a man maketh it stoop, but a good word maketh it glad. The righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the way of the wicked seduces him. The slothful man roasteth not that which he took in hunting, but the substance of a diligent man is precious. In the way of righteousness is life, and in the pathway thereof, there is no death.